Okay, Julie Roach here has won her first game. She's got $100. Now she's going to have a go at over $5,000. We wish her well. Thank you. Ready? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Julie, we polled a recent studio audience, and we got their best response to this. <laughs> Falling blank. Now, the answer they gave most often is worth $500 if you match that answer. Second, $250. Third, $100. Okay, now, which celebrities would you like to get a little help from? Richard. Richard. Your falling star. Falling star. There's oh. one. Meredith. Well, falling star was my first response. Um, falling tree. Falling tree. Name of an Indian girl, I think. <laughs> an, an Indian lady? And Marsha. Have you got one? Falling down. Falling down. Okay, you got falling tree, falling star, and falling down. Now, you can choose one of those or give us one of your own if you'd like. What would you like to do? I'll go with star. You go with star, falling star. Catch a falling star and put it... All right, that's the one we're looking for. Falling star. You think it's up there? Well, we're going to find out right now. First, may we see the $100 response. Falling rocks. That's worse than Did mine. Did you have rocks? Yeah. For, uh, yeah, they didn't right. call Okay. Like Still looking for falling star. Here is the $250 response. Falling down is the one that Marcia gave you. Last chance for falling, falling star, star, Julie. Here is the $500 response. Star it is. You got it. Congratulations. I know you're excited. You're jiggling my microphone. I saw a second one. All right, there it is. It's okay now. I'm very happy for you. You got the $500? That means you're going to be playing for 10 times that amount now, or... Bing! $5,000. Remember, you got to match one celebrity. It has to be exact. Choose one now, please. Richard. Good old Richard. Oh, Isn't that sweet? Because I've done so well this week. That's why they choose. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Richard will get ready to write, and you face me if you would, please. Here is the $5,000 question. Navy blank. Now, he is finished. Julie, you give us your response to that. Navy blue. Navy blue is her answer. You think she's right. You think she's right. We're going to find out right now, Richard. For $5,000, may we see your response, please? Well, you know, when I guess star, she hugged you and did nothing to me at all. Right. Yeah. Not even a peck on the cheek. Really? So, I mean, there's no incentive for me to do anything, right? Ooh, sorry so I to put blue anyway. <laughs> $600, you got a perfect round going here, and I know you're very excited, and you can use the money, right? What, are you getting cramps there? What are you going on? Money gives her stomach cramps. <laughs> what are you going to do with your money? <laughs> I say you're going to buy a, you're going to buy an oxygen yes. tank, I yeah. think. Yeah. That's what she's going to do, part of it. This well, oh, that there's the winning card. You can take that and frame it, and uh, we wish you well. As we introduce another player, Julie, here comes Virginia Shook. Hello there, Virginia. <laughs> How are you, Virginia? I'm fine. We're happy to meet you. Are you happy to be here? Uh, <laughs> I, I believe so. Well, Good. Yeah. Yes, I am. Where are you from and all that? I'm from Torrance, where I live with my husband, Howard. Yay! Good. And, and two children. beautiful daughters. Are those your daughters out there? Uh, no, they're not. Oh. Well, my mom and dad are down here. Your, is that your mom and dad right, right there? Right here on the corner. The first row. Uh-huh, the yeah. beautiful blonde-haired woman. <clears throat> oh, yes. <laughs> and the Virginia. handsome gentleman next to Okay. I have to say nice to have all of you here. You. And you got a lot of rooters here, and we wish both of you ladies well. Let's begin the game. Virginia, the challenger makes a selection. My daughters told me to pick B. Your daughter said B. Well, that's what uh, we're going to do for you. Have they ever lied to you before? Uh, <laughs> not yet. All right. 
right, here we go. It's an old Eskimo custom. Oh, yes, I, I know it is. <laughs> an old Eskimo custom that on their wedding night, the happy couple share their bed with a blank. <laughs> it's an old Eskimo custom. That on their wedding night, the happy couple share their bed with a... Don't think too hard, Brett. You're going to strain you something. Think of those little... Well, never no, 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 mind. No, 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 just uh, no clues there. Just go right ahead and... Put something on that card. All set over there now. Okay, Virginia, it's an old Eskimo custom that on their wedding night, the happy couple share their bed with a... Terrible answer. Friend. A what? <laughs> friend. A friend. She said a friend. They share their bed with a friend. That is an old Eskimo custom. If you... What do you say there? That's or... pretty well, weird, Virginia. That's disgusting. A polar bear? <laughs> wow. Polar bear? That's okay. the most best friend. <laughs> All right, Brett. Friend is the answer she's looking you for. You know, the answer I wanted to give was pelican. I didn't think of it until afterwards, but it didn't make any difference anyway. Pelican? I... Pelican, yeah. What do you say? You know what a pelican is. Yeah. No, I wouldn't want to share it's my pen. It's a bird with a tuxedo on, right? No. <laughs> is that wrong? No, that's a penguin. Oh, yes. Very good. Thank you. What well, did you say? I didn't well, say any of that. <laughs> Well, you say any of that. Well, why do you do that old dumb explanation if you didn't say that? Oh, dear Charles. You know, it took her three years to learn tuna fish. <laughs> Seal. I'm sorry. Seal. Yeah. Friend is the answer Virginia's looking for. And what do you say, Meredith? I was going to say polar bear, but I said with a husky sled dog. A husky sled dog. That's disgusting. Oh, I used to okay. sleep with two Great Danes. Really? Yes. Yeah, they keep you warm, don't yes. they? Richard? Oh, I wouldn't mind going to bear with a Great Dane. <laughs> <laughs> Someone like Liv Ullman. <laughs> I said seal. Seal. Friend is her answer. And what's yours, Marcia? A seal that they know well. well a seal. A friendly seal. Okay, no match at all there, Virginia. And we've got a question for you coming up, Julie. But first, this is coming your way, friends. A message for you.